Hi, this is Wizzy. Today we're going to make the printable of the fairy doll book and it's quite a high resolution PDF file so print on your best quality so that you can get nice images. We're going to cut the interior pages into strips but don't glue them together yet. And to begin with we are going to make mountain folds to the left side of each title page. The book is an anthology so there are several little stories in there and I designed the book so that each open spread of pages would be one story which I know is not how books are traditionally made but that is um, what would look good looking over the shoulder of a doll. So once you have your mountain folds you want to match them up so that the front of the book is lined up and nice and tidy. Then we're going to fold in the end pages so that everything is squared away. We're going to glue the pages together now and I use the cap of my glue stick to burnish the pages so that they are crisp on the edges and nice and flat. And we're going to do these in two separate sections. I just find it easier that way. And now it's time to glue these two sections together. And that's the inside of the book. For the cover, I use a straight edge. I'm using cardstock here just to define the edges of the cover and also the spine. Once you have all of your fold edges, you want to snip the top and bottom of the spine and then mitre the corners. Now we're going to glue the cover and we're going to turn in the top and bottom of the spine, make sure that the cover is the right way up. And then we center the pages top to bottom and we line up the spine edge of the first page with the crease in the cover for the front cover and fold in the mitered edges. You can see the spine is not actually glued to the spine of the cover. You want to bend the spine outwards slightly so that you can line up the spine edge of the last page with the fold in the back cover. And here is your book all done. Now if you were giving this as a gift or to keep on your dollhouse bookshelf you could add end papers in here. You could make an entire box full of these little books and then your dolls could have their own little book club. I really hope you've enjoyed making this book with me. Have fun.